When it comes to rivalries for Cal Poly football, just one team comes to mind. UC Davis in the battle for the Golden Horseshoe. The Aggies lead the all-time series over the Mustangs 21-20-2, and the teams are tied 7-7 since a trophy was introduced in 2004. Let's gallop over to Alex G. Spano Stadium, the first home game since the passing of Cal Poly alum and Chargers owner Alex Spanos on October 9th. First drive of the game for Cal Poly, the give to Joe Pro throw. He busts through the line, and there's nothing but green grass in front of him. 35 yards to the house, Mustangs draw, first blood, 7-0. Very next drive, here come the Mustangs again. The pitch to Drew Hernandez. He busted up the left side, across midfield, inside the 30, and he's knocked down at the 22-yard line. It sets up a field goal, and the Mustangs lead it 10-0. But you couldn't hold down the Aggies offense for long. Second quarter, Jake Meyer hooks up with Wesley Priest for the nine-yard touchdown. Davis cuts it to three. And they put on their horse power to good use. Hand off Yolanzo Gilliam. The Mustangs can't bring him down. Seven yards to Pater, just like that. It's 21 to 10 Aggies. Then before the break, Meyer play action over the middle. He connects with Keelan Doss for the touchdown. One of five TD passes on the afternoon for Meyer. 31-10 at the half, and the Aggies hold on to the Golden Horseshoe for the second straight year. They score 52 unanswered points and cruise past Cal Poly 52-10 the final. Overall, we got outplayed, outcoached. I, mean, I can't say it any other way. I take responsibility for it, and I'm not happy about it. Uh, but as, as young men, we have to come back, and as an old man, we got to come back, and we got to face the reality that we got a long ways to go to be able to compete against the Eastern Washingtons and right now the Eastern Davis is in the world. Next up for Cal Poly, a trip to Northern Arizona.